like I've told you many times before on a cruise ship, there is so much to do when you're on a cruise. For instance, every day when you're on the Harmony of the Seas of one of the Oasis class ships or many other ships, you'll get one of these. This is a cruise compass. It has a time, destination, a description of everything that's taking place on these ships. Because if you don't have one, you're going to pretty much miss everything there is. Because these new ships are basically floating cities and you need an itinerary. So this compass is on your door cabin every day when you come in. And you get a good description of where you're going, what time it is, so you can choose which events you want to attend. Because you can't do them all. But Cruise Compass is a big help. We're here on the Harmony of the Seas, one of the biggest ships in the sea. There's so much to see and do on this beautiful ship, we'd like to take you around. This is the Royal Promenade. Where do you see the boardwalk? It's a unique experience at sea. is this rising tide bar. It travels between deck five and deck eight. One of the really special areas on the ship is Central Park with real trees, great green plants, and birds. <laughs> The Oasis class ships are the only ships at sea that has central parks. Even on a cruise, you can still stay focused on your health and wellness. This is the Vitality at Sea Spa and Fitness Center by far.
The food on a cruise is great, but it's also easy to gain a little weight. So the best way to work off those extra calories is by working out in the gym. A cruise is a great family vacation idea. They've got adventure ocean activities for children of all ages, from tots to teens. The solarium is the adult only part of this ship that really, really, really gives you an opportunity to just get away from the kids and relax. What you have now is basically ships of floating resorts. People are taking the cruises now for the ship, not just the destination. The onboard activities are just unlimited. You can even book your next cruise while you're on board. One of my favorite places to hang out is the Schooner Bar. 